Congress's Rahul Gandhi has kicked off the Bharat Jora Nyaya Atra from Thawal district in Manipur following last-minute changes due to tensions in the state. Both Rahul Gandhi and Congress Chief Malakarjan Karge took a dig at the Prime Minister for not visiting Manipur as of yet. Rahul Gandhi accused the Prime Minister of not considering Manipur a part of the country. The Yatra, which spans... Oh, 67 days and is slated to cover 6,713 kilometers, will traverse across 110 districts, 100 Lok Sabha seats, and 337 assembly segments across 15 states. It will also conclude in Mumbai on the 20th of March and the 21st. The event faced obstacles earlier as the Manipur government initially had hesitated to grant permission for the Yatra, causing a political rift. The Congress has called it an ideological yatra and not an electoral yatra. But this comes as the nation prepares for its biggest election, which is just a few months away. नफरत फैली आज तक हिंदुस्तान के प्रधानमंत्री मणिपुर में आपके आंसू पोंछने आपसे गले लगने आपका हाथ पकड़ने नहीं आए शम की बात शायद नरेंद्र मोदी जी के लिए बीजेपी और आरएसएस के लिए मणिपुर हिंदुस्तान का भाग ही नहीं है मणिपुर को मोदी जी आते हैं वोट पूछने के लिए लेकिन जब मोदी जी यहां के लोग मुसीबत में है तो उस वक्त इधर मुंह नहीं दिखाते वो समंदर के ऊपर शहर करते फिरते हैं और बैठे जगह जप करते बैठते हैं राम 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 अरे भाई मुख में राम बगल में छुरी ये मत करो जनता के साथ सभी को भगवान की याद आती है भगवान के बारे में सभी लोग आस्था रखते हैं इसमें कोई शक नहीं है लेकिन वोटों के लिए मत करो Uh, sir, today Rahul Gandhi is going to start this Bharat Jodo Yatra from the state of Manipur. He said that it was a deliberate attempt to choose Manipur because the people have faced a lot of problems here. What message does the Congress Party wants to give? Thank you. First of all, I want to give also my heartfelt, um, uh, sincere uh, sympathies for people, all those who have uh, lost their dear near ones here. And Rahul's Yatra is a Yatra that has been taken to get justice for all those who have not gotten justice, but it's young people, women, farmers, and Manipur has seen so much violence. Uh, I think this is the place that Rahulji has chosen to start this yatra. This is a Nyaya yatra. This is uh, something that he wants to do, the Congress party wants to do. And uh, Imphal Manipur, which is the place where the government of India and the BJP have totally neglected the people, the sentiments. For months, there was violence, there was murder, there was rape. Uh, all sorts of atrocities were conducted, and I think this is something that uh, a civil society cannot tolerate. From today onwards, uh, Congress leader Rahul Gandhi is going to begin this Bharat Jodo Nyaya Yatra. As currently, this uh, Yatra is going to start from the state of Manipur, and Rahul Gandhi, in his speech, has mentioned it very clearly that it was uh, his idea. He was quite adamant that this Yatra must start from the state of Manipur because he mentioned that uh, uh, from the past eight months there is so much of violence that had taken place in the state of Manipur, and uh, there is a, an attempt which was being made to spread hatred amongst the people of Manipur. And that is the reason why it was very much necessary uh, that the Congress party should start this yatra from Manipur because Rahul Gandhi has mentioned uh, that as uh, the Lok Sabha elections are coming in and we cannot do up the yatra and that is the reason why uh, this, uh, this proposal was being made to take out a bus yatra but it was uh, his idea, it was Rahul Gandhi's idea to start this yatra from the state of Manipur because he has also made an attack on Prime Minister Narendra Modi. He said that he can visit to other states. He, uh, he went to uh, some other states for campaigning but uh, no one had come here for uh, for wiping the tears of the people of Manipur. He also mentioned and uh, 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 criticized BJP as well as RSS by saying uh, that uh, it seems like BJP, RSS as well as Prime Minister Narendra Modi doesn't, uh, doesn't uh, believe that Manipur is a part of India.